back in Berlin now. Really excited to be here. It's really nice to go home, see friends and family, but I'm excited to be back here, set a proper routine, and uh, get the show on the road. ultimately going to be one of the main ingredients for success in trying to become a recognized musician and it's got to be a strong balance between exercise, practicing, playing shows, doing this vlog. Throughout the period of this vlog I'll be telling a lot of stories and giving you updates on how the mission is going to become a successful and recognized musician and I'll also be just explaining all the little things that I'm going through each day that are interesting, what I'm learning, funny. When you say successful musician, a lot of people think, you know, famous or making tons of money. Success to me just means really finding that true fulfillment with what you want to do and what makes you really happy. And that is music for me. So this is really day one in Berlin. Let's get started with a proper routine. I think 90% of people would agree with me on this, that exercise sucks. But once you get into a routine of exercise, you just start to really love it. And you can see that with people, think of the people you know and the ones that exercise, they love it. And then you have friends that don't exercise at all. There's only really two types of people. I'm going to start running or try. I've never been much of a runner, but I'm going to start running because every running person I know is a, is a fanatic and loves it. So I'm going to start running every day and see what that does to my body. Good run. I'm in the subway and someone just forgot their credit card in one of those machines you get a ticket. I don't know what to do because that sucks. I was thinking of taking it and then his name was on the card so I would follow up with him on Facebook or something but what if he's coming back to pick it up right now so hmm, I don't know what to do. So I'm gonna hide it on top. Make sure no one's listening to me. I'm gonna hide it on top of the thing and then try to find him on Facebook or something and look him up and say, here's where it is and here's where you can get it. Because if he's coming back, he'll find it on top because he'll be looking for it around, I'm sure. If not, who knows? Anyway, the train's coming. I'm headed to the studio right now. I'm going to meet Martin, who is the mixer I'm working with and we're gonna go over the songs together to make sure we're on the right uh, here we go to make sure we are on the same page as um, basically when you finish the recording of all your songs you give it to the mix a mixer and it's their job to mix the songs and make it sound really professional like you could put it on the radio so there's very there's technical aspects to it there's also the tasteful aspects. And it's the tasteful aspects that can really make or break the song for the artist. And so it's the mixer's job to get inside the head of the artist. So for me, Martin has to get inside my head to really understand what I like and what the song should be like. So I'm going there now. We'll spend a couple hours there to get aligned on everything. Just had a really successful meeting with my mixer. Very excited about the album now and the songs. Um, the next step is to get the mix, which will take about a week or so. Then there'll be some revisions, and then they will come out. Mm -hmm. 